Hi guys, so in this R20 feature video, we are going to be looking at the new updates to the Radeon Pro Render, which is inside Cinema 4D. We've got some cool stuff that's been added, um, largely just uh, some maybe simple things about speed updates, um, just simply how fast it works its way to resolving the images that we are working with within Cinema 4D, which is absolutely brilliant. Um, and not only that, but that's also in the, you know, the offline render as well, which means that animation has now become a real possibility within Radeon Pro Render. So much so that one of the features that we have added now within Pro Render is motion blur. We've now got the option of adding linear and subplane motion blur into our Pro Render output, which is absolutely brilliant. As well as, as you can see up here, multi-passes. We've now got multi-pass abilities with Radeon Pro Render. So hopefully that will increase people's use of this um, really exceptional renderer, um, which is capable of producing some brilliant results. Another really useful thing that's been added is the fact that it will now work with the physical sky. So as you can see, we are getting decent lighting from our sky object as well. It is now illuminating our scene, meaning that you can have a, a you know some different times of day and things like that to help just improve and increase all sorts of things uh, to do with your scenes. You know, better lighting, better location, so on and so forth, just to help add that little extra bits of realism to your scene. Adding to that is the fact that we now have subsurface scattering within Cinema 4D's Radeon Pro Render. So if I'm just gonna create myself a Pro Render light and just turn that around really fast, I'm gonna create myself a new PBR material, which I will add to my figures. And then as before, you need to go into your luminance channel and then under your luminance texture surfaces uh, sorry effects subsurface scattering and there we go quite quickly cinema 4d is able to resolve that subsurface scattering and adds even more realism and even more possibilities to your pro render experience Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe or check out blog.maxon.co.uk.